Hey everyone and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. On this video we're going to be doing the main quest, Pompeius Magnus. Aya and Foxidas sail the Aegean Sea to rendezvous with Pompey Magnus and offer him gold, in a bid to ally him to Cleopatra's cause. But Ptolemy has other ideas, sending waves of ships against them. Foxidas and Aya beat back the attacks. The current objective is to sail to the Aegean coast. And we can hold R2 for battle speed to go quicker. But I'm actually not going to do that, so let me release that. Oh, it didn't even work. There we go, so I'm going to release it now. Rocks and rubble ahead! I'm not blind. I see the scaries. Your third voyage? Already you bark like a command crew. <laughs> I enjoy watching Spittle get caught in your beard, Foxy Das. Let's not be thrown into the sea. That's no death for such a hero as me. A real hero could swim to save himself. I see them, and not be sucked to a scupper for nothing. Now you're just trying to impress me. Alright, I can speed through here though. And then I'll have to slow down significantly. Sails on the horizon! There! Those colors are not from Rome. What mess has this boxy queen dragged us into? Ptolemy's ships. Sent by the order of ancients, no doubt. What business do they have with Pompeii? Pompey's armies will give Cleopatra the throne. They mean to prevent the alliance before it happens. We must hurry. Poseidon's peace. The air is already choked with smoke. The seas will steam near the volcano. We should keep our distance if we don't want to burn. Is that Methana? She hasn't burst for hundreds of years. It wouldn't surprise me if she burst now for us. Let loose storm sea dragons alongside her. You don't believe in that nonsense, do you, Foxidas? Come on now. Ready ourselves. Let's show these traitors they trust the wrong pharaoh. Alright, let's give them a volley. From this distance, it's probably not going to be that great. But you hold L2 and shoot it just like a regular bow. Of fire. Oh! The Incoming fire indicators. So, uh, we hold L1 so the arrows don't hurt us. It says, weak points, fire at enemy weak points to do major damage to enemy ships. Triple arrow volley, hold L2 and tap R2 three times. So let's do a triple arrow volley. Then block, and then release L1, you'll do a counter fire. So you block the fire they give you, and then you release it as soon as it hits. Oops, missed that one. Right, I'm gonna ram him. All right, we got two more ships. Also, when you get close to an enemy ship, you'll get the option to use fire bombs as well. Incoming arrows. Let them hit and release for the counter fire. We've got these Malakia. Come and get them. These are wings. They're full of. Right, I'm gonna ram these guys. Ah, miss those arrows. Firebombs and ram. Taken out. I need to do a better job of blocking these. Here comes the arrows block and counter fire. Pick up the pace. It's ramming time. Careful with your jibes, Captain. Pompey is a needed ally, and no mean general. We didn't sail all this way just to offend him with insults. I am who I am. 
I do not change for kings or queens. I left my wife and kids behind for the same reason. No one sane accepts me. I accept you. We accept you. Allah! These hundred Naltai is enough acceptance for me. It's hard to say goodbye to those who don't accept us. But he is also the only way! Is it? Pompey will be at the appointed place, off Terra's coast. Sail on! Ramming and counterfire. Ramming ship. Sinking a ship by ramming speeds up reload. Counterfire. Hold L1 to brace and release it just after enemy projectiles strike your ship. Speed off! Alright, so this part, they don't do any talking. We can speed up a little bit. But then we need to come to a complete stop up ahead, otherwise you skip a bunch of audio, which is kind of dumb. Speed more speed! Right, we're gonna yeah, slow down here. Bombe sells north. Don't rush! There may be patrols ahead. Are you ordering me away from a fight? Eddie, shit, woman, of course not. But I am not keen to die protecting a Roman, especially one who can afford his own protection. You know, you really should join this trial. You'd fit right in. We're not here to protect Bombe, we're here to bribe him. Makes me sick to hear it. Wasn't it Cleopatra's father who did the same? Squander Egypt's wealth on fashion, fornication, and Pompey's annual fee. You put it bluntly, but yes. And you want us to trust his daughter? The queen is not her father. All she does, she does for Egypt's sake. As well as her own. Here we are, bringing Pompey more of Egypt's wealth, at her bidding. She's paying you as well, Foxidas. Handsomely, some might say. Why am I wasting words on politics? <laughs> Fire bombs ready! Call for them when we pull near! Ah, well, it skipped at the end. Oh well. Alright, so we got, it looks like, five ships, and we need to defend Pompey's Octoreem. Ready! Oh, we got arrows coming in. Counter! Oh, there's the weak point. Tore it up. Now we're gonna ram it. And firebombs to finish him. Oops. There we go. Countered that just in time. And ram kill. We'll break them! Or take them down with us! Actually, we're gonna ram them and then follow up with firebombs. Oh, actually, the ram killed it. Off the pace, brothers! Grinning arrows! Heave a galley speed! Arrows! Counter! Firebomb finish. One more remains. That was brave work. There might be more to you than royal cuts. Mind your tongue, old man, or you'll discover a legend sword play and save it. Oh, you guys are gonna get the ram. More arrows. Counter. Finish them. Now let's find this Metro Coites. I've never met a Roman general face to face before. Ah, don't worry, I am. Uh, I'll be on my best behavior. Civil war in Egypt and a mercenary trireme comes to my aid. In the midst of war with Caesar, I find it odd. Who in Hades are you? Well, we could have let you die.
Pompeius Magnus. Greetings and friendship from Queen Cleopatra. Cleopatra offers gold to win my favor once I've won Rome. Is that what friendship means to your queen? Whose face graces that coin? Do Roman women receive the same honor? An alliance with Cleopatra is a union of true power. She wants more than an ally. She seeks a king. A valuable friendship indeed. Agreed. My fleet will soon be ready for Egypt. And we completed that quest, Pompeius Magnus, and that'll get us a trophy. It also gave us a new main story quest, Ambush at Sea, but that one's a level 28 quest. We are quite a ways from that. There's our trophy. Alright, so let's do a couple things before we wrap this up. I never completed this location where I killed Taharka. We got... Drachmas all over the place. What's this? Sea of Sand. In southeast in Iment Nome, or of Iment Nome, lies a broken ship. Past time till morning, an X will mark my hiding spot. Something to do with shadows. Let's see, is there stuff up there? Uh, up on the rooftop, although those should be quivers. I might actually need sleep darts, though. Let me see. <laughs> Is that a quiver? Yeah, that's a quiver. I assume the ones up top are as well. I was on autopilot. Did I complete the location? I did. Okay. Uh, so, let's go, uh, see about some upgrades. I definitely need to upgrade my bow, or at least one of them. I don't think I'll upgrade both, but one of them needs an upgrade, and... May as well get some new skins and upgrade one of my weapons. Might go back to the hammer for a little bit. Been using the sickle sword for a while. It's best to get a bunch of levels on an upgrade because the price is the same regardless. Well, I guess we will go see the weaver first. Greetings. Can I help you? What do you have for me? Inge Narok. It's a rare outfit. Elder Masai warrior donned this robe as a sign of their power. Sure. Kind of expensive, but we got money. All right, let's put that on. Go to gear. Oh, actually, I may as well get a, a trophy while I'm here. There's a trophy for putting all legendary stuff on, so let's put the Desert Cobra on and a legendary mount. Roman war horse, I suppose. Actually, let's go with the Pharaoh's horse. And there's the trophy. I'm a legend. Obviously, you can't have a uh, legendary tool. But everything else is legendary. Alright, so uh, let's go check out my new skin. And we'll leave that for a second because I'm about to get a new mount. And while I'm in here, I guess we may as well break some stuff. Tiltuba bow. This Assyrian bow was quite useful in the battle at Tiltuba for foot archers. Victoria, I think we had that before. What about melee weapons? We've got a bronze Kopesh. Well, actually, do I want to sell these for gold? Or uh, drachma, I mean? Maybe. Motivational duet. These blades work relentlessly, so you don't have to. I think we had that before. Uh, we're just going to sell these, I think. A little extra drachma. 
And the same with the shield. Alright, uh, who's next? We've got the blacksmith over there. Hi! Uh, hello, hello! Uh, well, I guess I'll sell first. We'll sell all unnecessary items. Agreed. And quite a bit. Uh, what else we got? We got this stuff. We'll sell the motivational duet. Uh, 72 drachma. Uh, bronze kopesh, we can get rid of that. And the metal shield. Okay, upgrades. Let's see. That's a level 15. I think the... Yeah, the Eye of a Pep's only level 12. Let's go back to the hammer. Or whatever you want to call this thing. Heavy blunt weapon. Uh, 3,000, is it? Normally 3,000? Guess so. Anyways, upgrade that. And let's see. I'm kind of leaning more towards the Death Storm. I haven't been very impressed with the Crimson Death, and it's actually high level. Hmm. Do I need to upgrade my shield? No, my shield's good. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna upgrade the Death Storm. Use that as my main bow. And that's, ooh, 4,000 drachma. Maybe I should wait. Actually, no, let's upgrade it. We'll spend that money. Okay. A pleasure. And I guess we'll get a new horse. Getting a little low on money, but I'm good on supplies and such. So, what do you got for me? What about a... Uh, let's go back to a horse. How about Rusty? Found abandoned in a rickety cage on the bank of the Nile. He might have been imprisoned there for too long, as his legs are prone to cramping. Well, we'll try him out. Give the guy a chance at life. Uh, there's my new quest. Let me just highlight that so it goes away. We have the new horse, Rusty. And, oh. Well, Death Storm is already equipped, so that's fine. This, let's see. We'll put the Sickle Sword as the offhand. Oh, I can't. Um, well, whatever, we'll just put there, there. Or there, there. That there. Sickle Sword in the offhand. I have a pep in the main hand. And I think that's it. Abilities, I've got two points. Hmm. Well, I suppose I will get Elite Ranger because I need that for a trophy. Aiming with your bow. Oh, wait, that costs three. Never mind. What else can we get? Salesman. Hmm, could get more money. It is a passive. Although I just freaking did that. Figures, right? Um, well, let's just get it now. My timing on that was not ideal. What is this? Tool kill experience. Killing enemies with a tool grants experience. Tools, flush decay, poison darts, firebombs. Eh. What's this one? Buy materials. You can purchase crafting materials from shops, blacksmith, and weaver shops. Sell different types of materials. Uh, nah, I'm good. Berserk? Press L3 to use this substance on a lower level unaware enemy and turn him against his allies. Hmm. That could be interesting. Oh, I was targeting the wrong thing though. Flush Decay is the one I'm at. Oh, I think that's what my weapon does automatically. Where it just sort of stuns them. Uh, I guess I could get it. I could also get smokescreen damage. Uh, let's just hold on to this point for now. I don't see anything, like, really great. So we'll keep a hold of that. Inventory, I've got the letter to Sefetu. I already read that before. We got the new, uh, papyrus puzzle. 
And targets is new. The Scarab. Taharka. Taharka was the mythical scarab who haunted Saïs and Letopolis. A great man who caused terrible pain in pursuit of a quest to build monuments that would outlive him. In his darkest moments, Bayek understood Taharka all too well. The man had to die for the blood on his hands, but Bayek prays he wasn't simply carried or he hasn't simply carried forward the cycle of vengeance. Alright, let's check out the new horse and then we will be done. Oh, and this is my new skin. I like it. It's interesting. Not bad. And there's the new horse, Rusty. Okay, we are all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.